Hi, my name is Joseph. And I'm Sarah. And we've been coming to the Wave World Outreach for 10 years now. I've been coming to church. I was so full of fear, shame, and guilt. It was causing a lot of issues to stand firm on my faith so that that wasn't lacking in my house. And no matter how hard I tried, it, I couldn't fulfill that role that was missing. And I was losing my connection to my children, bringing just chaos into the home. A lot of arguing, a lot of fighting. There wasn't a sense of security in our home because of what he was doing, just the back and forth thing, coming when he wanted to, leaving when he wanted to. Things were always up and down. It was just a constant state of walking on eggshells and just not feeling safe. I had already given up on myself and I felt that she should just give up on me too. I felt like it's not working when I'm gone. It's not working when I'm here. I just felt like hopeless in the moment. Grabbed a bottle of Tylenol and took two handfuls of it. My wife found me on the kitchen floor. I spent a few days in a psych ward as they were evaluating me and everything. It's stuff that we have to face because that's stuff that God's trying to set us free from. Through all the classes, we've gotten a lot of freedom. We've gotten deliverance. Arguments will arise. We're on the path that, that God's been trying to get us on. Amen. We're finally on that path and we can see where God wants to take us instead of being detoured by all these things that we were dealing with and the struggles that we were facing. Now we have a clearer picture of where God wants us, not only not only separately for ourselves, but together. And I know the importance of forgiving. I no longer hold any uh, bitterness towards myself. I can now truly love my wife and love my children and love God. Even if we do deal with these things, we don't have to stay there. It's not gonna hold us back. Like we have the, we have people to reach out to when we're dealing with these things again. It's not gonna be the same as it was before where we didn't know what to do and we would go to these outlets to deal with them. Now we have the foundation that we needed and the tools that we needed to, to be successful in that and to, and to keep going. We couldn't ignore it anymore. I want to be free and having that reality check, like if like there's a real enemy who will do anything to get, to take me out.